Hey gang, welcome to the new moon for February the 9th. It's tomorrow is Chinese New Year or some people call it Lunar New Year. And it's really a time for everyone to just really restart the engine. You know, some people believe in um, New Year's. The first is the New Year. Some people believe in many different things, but whatever we do, it has to resonate within yourself. That's the theme for the new moon for this month. Um, as you can see how quiet it is. The other day I got my hair cut. I didn't even tell her how much I wanted to be cut off. She just got her razor blade and that's why I love going with her. She did old school way of just razoring it down, not with a scissors, but with a razor. So she chopped a good, um, I think six inches because it was, I was just looking at my other picture. It was all the way down to here. So, well, here it is. I got a new color and a new thing to start the new year or the new lunar year. And so just so happened the new moon falls right before the lunar new year that starts tomorrow. So what do we do during these times when we feel that some of the energies are just all over the place? I mean, I woke up on Monday about two or three times and I said, okay, I really want to go to sleep. But I felt like I'm not here, but I'm somewhere else. It was such, like I was going down through a funnel, you know? It, it was an interesting feeling of what happened. And then two hours later, I woke up at 11. Thank God I have my own business and my assistant was waiting for her Zoom call that, and it was, I felt so bad. I felt like this is a new week, the new month and ready to go and rock and roll before I head out to LA. And gee, it took me to another like mindset. And so, <laughs> and the other thing is, is so weird is that I looked at my time and I looked at my clock and it was two hours again different. It was so weird. And I had to confess to my assistant the other day what happened. And she's like, are you okay? And I said, I don't know. And then today I was like, remember that day? It's just so weird that I'm looking for my floater. You know, the one you put in the pool or you put in a beach. It's a big, huge floater that you can lie on it. That thing is like humongous and it's gone, completely gone. The big floater, the round big floater is completely gone. I have no idea where it flew away. So I don't know how that happened. I, it's, it's like a six foot. And how does that thing come up? Anyways, I can't even go there, but those are the kind of things that is happening to some people. And some people are just getting into all of the mist of chaos. The chaos is going to start to come out. I mean, you have the left versus the right, the right versus the left. I mean, I can't, I, I can't even keep up with it. You know, the gender, now they have um, menstrual products inside the men's bathroom. And they said they also have it for the ladies. I don't know what's going on. Honestly, it's just getting where these illegal immigrants are getting $9,000 of spending money to welcome to America. And it's just kind of, weird on what's going on and I'm just part of that cycle of trying to figure things out at the same time because time really 
it just kind of disappear every day. It's like, okay, I need to take this time out to relax, to breathe, to do my exercise. And then I just get burnt out by the time it becomes that time to work out because there's just so many things going on. So new moon is a time to write down clearly, especially now is to anchor down during this crazy wind, rain, I mean, hurricane, earthquake, it's rattling, rocking, and rolling, like I mentioned last year in my YouTube. So don't forget to, you know, get back to my some of my old videos that I'm talking about what's going to happen, and it is happening. It feels like it's a vortex. And so it's time to really stay focused. People who has the dream, the power, the ones that you really want to do and say, what is your ikigai? What is your purpose? What is you? So stay strong this new moon. There is just so much distraction. Like today, there was an earthquake around the same time that LA had an earthquake. And it's like, I'm talking to Florida. And Florida's like, what are you talking about? An earthquake? You know, there's flooding. It, things that's happening here somehow trickles down to L.A. And L.A., you know, they're having a hard time with this huge rainfall. So a lot of things to, you know, put together and stay focused. Because if you stay focused, your ikigai, your purpose, your planning of seed for this. This thing is just shaking and there's no wind. There's just so many things that's happening, you know, the energy around us. And so really have that moment, have that peace, have that clarity for this new moon. Today, February 9th is the super moon. So that's why the energy, you know, is just very coming and bouncing and what we need to do is just stay focused so lots to do for this year your seed is like ready to come out of the soil you know you plant it in they're ready to pop out and there's a little bit of struggle where the earth is you know the soil is moving just like what is happening around us so people call it the new era the new world Whatever you want to call it, it is a new beginning. So stay strong. Do what you need to do. Focus because this year is the strong, strong money sign. It's also in the, the um, year of the dragon. So there's a lot of great heavy energy. Use that to your power so you can exceal for 2024 and 2025 is just going to be the start of a new life, a new you. Start working on it. I cut whatever that doesn't need it off my hair, like I said the other day. And, you know, I'm looking forward for new growth, a healthy growth. And I wish you all the best. So stay tuned for more of Coco Jar as we join in. Um, out in Pasadena for the um, West Groom Expo and of course introducing our medical microbubble system that is vet approved so don't forget to check our website at cocojord.com and don't forget to like us in our social medias as well. I'm Monica and I really appreciate you joining me tonight on the new moon in our Coco Jar Corner. Stay tuned for more Coco Jor Adventure, right here, and subscribe. Aloha.